Hello. Thank you for calling. I need to to speak to Garinder. I'm a helper today. Yes, Garinder. Hi. How are you today? Good. Thank you for asking. How can I help you? Yes. So I'm having a little bit of trouble with my printer. Every time I connect it, it will not turn on. It's not turning on. No, sir. Exactly, yeah, when I, even when I connect it. Okay, all right. Ma'am, in that case, you might have to change your uh, cable, right, okay, which connects you with power, or else uh, uh, you could uh, contact HP directly, okay, because it's a hardware issue, it's not a software problem, okay? Well, I was thinking maybe you could help me because, I mean, it is technically software. I mean, it, it, for some reason, there are all these letters and numbers that are jumbled on the screen. I just can't read them because they keep switching from backwards and forwards. It is not, ma'am. It's a hardware issue. What's, wait, what's the difference? You don't need to know the difference. It's a hardware problem. Write down the number if you want to call the direct department for the hardware issue. Rest is all your call, what you want to do. Wait, but, but sir, I mean, you sound pretty intelligent. I, I trust you. You don't have to, ma'am. Oh, I don't have to trust you? Oh, that's bad. Yeah, exactly. That's very bad. Why, why can't I trust you? There is nothing I could do for you. Don't trust me. Trust the one who could help you. Well, maybe, maybe you and I could go out to eat sometime. You well, sound so desperate, so don't like desperate people. Wait, but Especially. wait, but but I'm just putting myself out there. I'm not lonely. I mean, I have a job. I just, I just, I was just thinking. You seem so nice. Maybe we could go out to dinner. The person who has a job, right? Okay, wouldn't do this. What you're doing in the middle of the day? Anyway, I'm on, so, I'm on break. You still yes. I'm on break. Say, yeah, on break. Oh, so you are definitely desperate then. I'm not desperate. I just, yeah, I just. You don't have to explain it yourself. I get it. You know, there's so many people who are so insecure and desperate, just ready to talk to anyone over the phone, just trying to hide somewhere. So maybe you're one of those people. So I would say that you should probably see a psychiatrist and uh, just get yourself sorted out, okay? Or maybe just do some kind of. Uh, uh, meditation or something, okay? It'll help. Med meditation. Right. You, you mean like you mean like Ishakriya? No, no, not that, right? Okay, just read about meditation, maybe it would help. What what kind of meditation do you suggest? Do you think you could teach me? I would suggest anything, no. I wouldn't. Why? Not to you. What? We could have like we, could, we we could have like a meditation date. No. I don't think so. We we would be like the first people we would be like the first couple in history to do that. Everybody goes out to dinner in a movie, you and I, we can go out and meditate. No, that's not gonna happen. You sound so nice, please, please, please. Just just Well, I'm not nice at all. You're not well you seem nice. You're you're trying to help me. No, I am not trying to help you. I'm trying to get you direction because you're lost. So, I'm not lost. I, I, I know where I'm going. I, I think I'm driving the right way. No, you're not. I'm not? Oh, okay. Well, that, that would explain yeah. this cliff. Yeah. yeah, maybe you should uh, stop smoking a lot. <coughs> I don't smoke. Okay. <coughs> Get you going? Uh, uh, well, uh, uh, do you have any cigars? I could, I, I could use some cigars. Cigars? The yeah. Cuban one, or just a random, any, anyone will work out for I think anything will work for you. Yes, uh, anything, yes. <laughs> yeah, right, I figured it. You, you want a cigar? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Do you have any? Okay. No, I don't. You sound, you sound like you have a smoker's voice. Sound like? How does it sound like? You could feel it. How could, how could it sound like? Because it, it's like very like gravelly. Very gravelly. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, you're not practical at all. 
N- no, I, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of a reckless spender too. I spend money on everything. I, I, I think I only have like, I think I only have like twenty dollars to my name. Spend money on everything and dialing a toll-free number instead, rather than you know just being scared of talking to someone. You really know because I don't think so. Anybody would like to talk to you there, right? That's the reason I'm dialing a toll-free number. Well, I, I like strangers. You like strangers? I mean, there could be so many strangers near about you. Try to get them. Yeah, I, I, and there and there are many scammers too. There are many scammers out there who try to scam me out of money. Scammers? Yeah. What are you talking about. Like scammers who try to scamming who try to. Who like tra- they're scamming you where? Like in a club or something? No, no, on the telephone. On the telephone? Yeah. So why you? That's what I. That's what I'm telling you. You don't understand. I'm not telling you to talk over phone. I'm saying just go out. You know, go to a party. Go to a place where you could find someone you know who could be as desperate as you, and maybe you could go get along and just have fun. Yeah, but like, don't, 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 uh, don't two two desperate people. Isn't that like a bad match? No, it is not. It is a good match. Yeah, but like, but because like we'll be feeding off of each other's desperation, isn't that like a bad thing? It is a good thing, you know. Once you will be done, you'll be done. Once you end it. Wait, what? what? Makes you, you know, what, what, what makes you desperate? You should end it. And how could you end it? You could only end it with a desperate person, right? There is no other way you could end it. So you should end your desperation with a desperate person. Go get along with someone. Just find someone as useless as you, I would say, right? Who's dialing toll fee number in the middle of an evening, and that's not even Saturday. So, wait, you know, that's re- I'm, I'm 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 on I'm on break at work, and I needed help with my printer. I didn't expect to get a lesson on desperation. Oh, so I mean, seriously, like you are on work, and you in your break, you're dialing this number. So, do you? Understand how desperate you sound. I I I don't, I don't mean to be. I don't mean to be desperate. I I'm sorry. It's I've had I've had issues. Everybody's left me. Try try harder, right? Okay, maybe it will help you. I don't I don't I don't mean to sound desperate. I just people always leave me. I don't know why they leave me. <laughs> so desperate. That's why they leave you. That's why I'm saying you should find a desperate person. I don't know why I'm so desperate. I don't know why. I think you should make a Tinder account and just type it there. I just need desperate men. That's all. And it'll help you to find someone as desperate as you, maybe. Or maybe you'll have choices. You could figure it out which one you want to go with. What what choice? Well, that's why I'm that's why I'm saying you sound so nice. Like maybe maybe I could take you out to like a coffee shop or like a hookah, uh, smoke some hookah. <laughs>